in this session, we are discussing two important properties of normals to parabola. Here is the first one. Prove that if the normal at t1 to y square is equal to 4ax meets the parabola again at t2, then t2 is minus t1 minus 2 by t1. Here is the proof. First of all, I'm writing equation of normal at t1 to y square is equal to 4ax. And that equation is y is equal to minus t1x plus 2at1 plus at1q. Now, this normal meets the parabola again at point whose parameter is t2. And then that point I'm considering as q, which is at2 square comma 2at2. Now this point q lies on normal at t1. So I'm substituting these coordinates of point q in the equation number 1. I got it as 2at2 is equal to minus t1 into, in place of x we are substituting x coordinate, that is at2 square plus 2at1 plus at1q. Now this I got from equation number 1. Now in next step, I'm taking this 2at1 to left hand side. So you got it as 2at2 minus 2at1 is equal to minus t1 into at2 square plus at1q. Further on left hand side, we are taking 2a common and on right hand side, we are taking at1 common. So it becomes 2a into t2 minus t1 is equal to at1 into t1 square minus t2 square. In next step, from left hand side, I have taken minus sign common from this bracket. While on right hand side, this at1 I kept same and t1 square minus t2 square can be factorized as t1 plus t2 into t1 minus t2. Now look at this, you can cancel t1 minus t2 on both sides as well as a. Now left hand side simply remains minus 2 and right hand side is t1 into t1 plus t2. Now look at this expression, what we want to prove, it is the relation between t2 and t1. So I can modify further this as minus 2 by t1 is equal to t1 plus t2. In next step, I can write t2 is equal to minus t1 minus 2 by t1. This is the required proof. Here I'm going for the second one. Prove that if normal set points t1 and t2 to parabola y square is equal to 4x meets again on parabola at t3, then t1 into t2 is equal to 2. Now, according to previous proof, I can say that normal at t1, if it meets parabola again at point whose parameter is t3, then t3 is minus t1 minus 2 by t1. Now try to understand, normals are drawn at two points, t1 and t2. And both these normals meet the parabola again at t3. So whatever I have written this theory between t3 and t1, that is applicable between t3 and t2 also. So I can write similarly, t3 is minus t2 minus 2 by t2. Now if you look at left hand side of these two equations, they are same. So we are equating right hand side. Now, for simplification purpose, what I can do is I can take this term to left hand side while minus t1 goes to right hand side. So left hand side becomes 2 by t2 minus 2 by t1 is equal to right hand side is t1 minus t2. Now, on left hand side, I have taken two common. So it becomes 1 by t2 minus 1 by t1 is equal to t1 minus t2. In next step, I can write this as 2 times t1 minus t2 upon t1 into t2. So what I have done on left hand side is just cross multiplication while on right hand side I kept the terms as it is. I hope you understand we can cancel t1 minus t2 on both sides. So it becomes 2 upon t1 into t2 is equal to 1. In next step if you take t1 into t2 to the other side it becomes simply 2 is equal to t1 into t2. That is what the required proof. So I got t1 into t2 is equal to 2. Thank you.